Should I buy Bitcoin now? Well, some important people believe so. So if you want to know everything about the crypto world that you need to know right now, the last information, and know if it's a good or a bad moment for buying Bitcoin, smash that like button because it's time for crypto news fun on the right crypto at top. Today, we are going to tell you we are happy because Bitcoin went up we were thinking about dying because we lost the line. We can't lose 28,888. And then we just uh, survived that line and we just went to find resistance in the $30,000 line, which is the line that we need to go above in order to be in party ball. Remember, we told you what we think is going to happen with Bitcoin in August and the path for Bitcoin to the million dollars in the last video. Do not miss those out and smash the like button and use the link in the description if you want to help us. Yesterday, I told you this exact path for Bitcoin to the million dollars through the next halving and the new all-time hype. So maybe for April 2025, we'll be so happy. But I have to tell you that Benjamin Cohen just released this tweet telling us that he nailed his expectation about July's month behavior for Bitcoin. He said that in July of the pre-halving years, the average is minus 4.74%. So uh, the result for July 2023 was minus 4.09%. Now, the average return of Bitcoin in August of its pre-halving years is minus 21.3%. So we can expect something like minus 20%. That was not our prediction watch our video we are following the path of 2016 2015 and if that's correct because all those candles are similar then today we zoom in a little bit more and i will tell you what i think is going to be the behavior of this candle remember i'm not expert this is not financial advice I have no clue whatsoever what's going to happen. Not even Satoshi Nakamoto knows what's going to happen with speculation price for Bitcoin. But I believe that if we are representing right now this first of three green candles, you can see we went as high as these two candles and not as much as the one that got us to the first impulse there. So I expect something like 31,500 for the week and maybe the candle close uh, can be something around 30,500. So we have a green candle, but not so very green, something like that. And what about the south part? Well, I believe as we uh, did here, uh, just compare the week with the previous month. Well, I believe it's going to be something similar. So maybe precisely the 28,888 can be the less for uh, the week of the candle. And remember, that's important because of this support trend. We have here this random line. And also consider that maybe we are going to still going up or not. We'll see. But According to this other crazy theory we have in the three day chart that we can see here on TradingView. Once we are down uh, the support, you can see the line here, also here and also here. We go in two candles of three days uh, just below it and then we go crazy up, below it, crazy up. So right now, maybe we were already two candles below the support and now we are going to go up starting these three next days what do you think about that any case are you going to trade are you going to buy some crypto then use our friends coin x you have the link in the description remember they have a draw for ethereum so register with our link and you can participate and make some money there with coin x spanish on their twitter also they have uh, Coinex Global, not just Spanish. So follow both channels on Twitter 
and they are going to throw uh, some contests and draws in both channels. So follow both of them. Dollar here, you can see that we are still finding resistance in this line. So I still happy. Maybe that's why Bitcoin is going a little bit up right now. And maybe because of this piece of information that we knew in precisely CoinEx Global, CoinEx.com, uh, it's that Michael Saylor MicroStrategy bought 467 more Bitcoin for 14 million and a half dollars. So you can see that uh, this probably is the bonds for Bitcoin. And right now, MicroStrategy owning, uh, owning uh, 152,800 Bitcoin, which is around $4.5 billion dollars. Uh, paid uh, MicroStrategy paid 30,835 per Bitcoin in this last purchase. And this is the last purchase since 2021 for MicroStrategy. You can see here a lot of data about the company. And you can see that this bot is all performing all the other major financial assets in the company since adoption. So this company have things clear. Uh, remember, if BlackRock wants in, if all those institutions want in, they are going to have to buy to Michael Saylor and price will go crazy high. More good news, just in 500 billion banking giant Nomura wins full license to offer Bitcoin services in Dubai, allegedly. So more adoption. And again, we have a look at the cycle chart for Bitcoin. Remember, we always have three good years, one bad year, three good years, one bad year, three good years, one bad year. Maybe we are in the three good years for Bitcoin. Hopefully so. The stock market in Asia going down, down and down three days in a row. What's going to happen with United States today? Gold is going up, crypto is going down. The market still is neutral. 53 today and about some fiascos we told you about yesterday do not miss those out curve dow is going up in price also the stable coin is being stable once again the market in the red right now the bubbles trying to be green bone was something like this well you have to go to dextools.io in order to see what's going on there and this has to be with siva Schwab. So SIVA related, uh, you have to go to dextools.io uh, and there you have a lot of information about the token you don't know about. And also you can go uh, to their Twitter or as Elon Musk calls it now, X. And remember, we told you yesterday, but we are expecting something special coming soon. What is all that about? We'll tell you here in fun on the right. So there you will know about uh, Shiba Inu and it's birthday, three years of birthday for Shiba Inu right now. And now about Bone, well, we have uh, this thing, uh, it's going to be used uh, in the Layer 2 blockchain that is going to be allegedly uploaded this month. In the most important ones, of the most important ones, you can see uh, that uh, Curve DAO is there also bone, also flex. And if we go to the wars, uh, we can see still some stable coins there. So not really bad news right now. Coinbase adding support to Ripple and Litecoin again. Well, that was good for XRP. Now, not very good. And for Litecoin going down, but it had a minor pump because of this. And we are six hours away in the moment we record this video to the Litecoin halving. So maybe as you are watching this video, the Litecoin halving happened already. We will tell you everything about that on tomorrow's video. Ethereum trying to find support in the moving average of 100 days. So come on, let's go up. And as we talk about August for Bitcoin yesterday. Let's talk about Ethereum in the monthly chart today. You can see here that we had in July three green candles and five red candles because the last one was in the red. So another red July for Ethereum. But about August, you can see here we have the same 
five red Aguses and three green ones. Now, is it going to be red or green? Well, probably red if we see that we have more red than green. Also, consider that we were in a good trend of six uh, red green candles, and now it is a bad thing that we broke that uh, that green tendency with a red one. We had six green candles here. We also had seven candles here. So now one of six in a row. And if you see how many times we had two red months in July, August, July, August, July, August. Well, uh, comparing with the two times we had green, green, July and August. Also there is a win for the red candle in Ethereum. Any case, I want to highlight that this has been the most long period flat for Ethereum in its history. So I think it might explode sometime. It's finding support there. As for me, it was desperation at $220. Remember that? And then we broke it for good. So I expect this movement to happen at some point in the future. And at some point in the future, I'm going to be in Galicia, in Block Galicia, the most important meeting we are going to have right now. I will be there. Thank you, Block Galicia. Uh, they retweeted me uh, in their tweeted account. So follow them. I leave you the link below. Maybe you want to go there and we will meet. This will be from 28th to 30th of September 2023 in Santiago, in Spain, where we will eat the best seafood in the world and party all the time. Also, we will learn a lot about crypto world, about blockchain, and we will meet with a lot of friends and the most important companies in the country and out the country too. So maybe you want to buy your ticket, but as you are a rider, you have, of course, a discount. So thank you very much to Block Galicia, uh, powered by DexTools.io. Link in the description. If you use that link, you have uh, to use no code at all whatsoever. Just click on the link and you will see that you have a discount applied already of 30% in previous video. I help you to uh, do percentages. So if you learn that, you will know that you come from $49.95 to $34.97, but just the 21st tickets. So do it right now or you might miss this discount. I retweeted this on our tweet account so you can see there the 30% discount and I will tell you about this in the future. We will have a good time there. So join us, please. And now for good technology, this topic or not, what do you think about this gaming setup for rising? It's out of this world. Just picture this with the glasses where you are also in another dimension. And what about this that Mark Vidal brings us Amazon and its robots. This looks like a Pixar movie, but it's not. This has 750,000 robots all over the world. And you can see that uh, one of these huge machines, Robin, uh, classified more than a thousand million packages in just 2022. It's crazy how uh, automation and how robotics is going to change our world, this looks like the minions, but those are robots. And now for good riders, thank you very much for the rider that told us about this project that he created. It's called godsi.art. So there you have AI collections with beautiful people there that are related with AI and those talk, etc., etc. So maybe you want to buy one of those. Any case, for me, the idea sharing this is that more and more we have riders that they try their best to make a living in the crypto world. So I will share some of those from time to time. Thank you very much. Also, because it reminds me, long time since I went to OpenSea.io to see my NFT collection. So if you want to send me one of those NFTs to my address, 
I will show it in next shows, of course. And talking about NFTs, you need to know that Trump NFTs skyrocketed 650% in sales after ex-president indicted for allegedly attempting to overturn 2020 election. Crazy stuff. Trump is not backing Bitcoin. It's uh, trying to kill it, but making money through NFTs. And what about AR, augmented reality? Here you can see augmented reality meeting a billboard. Incredible things that we will see in the future. This is just the beginning. So maybe you want to be different from the rest of the world and hang upside down like this bird. Well, if you do that, you need to consider that more and more people, your family, your friends will come and will try to charge you to the right position again. So you will have to fight it if you want to hold to your crazy ideas. Expect some fight, some pressure and go maybe and find the place where you can be free. Fight for your freedom and do not get too crazy like this dog that believes it's an ambulance what is going on there what about this cat that believes is a seal the other cat maybe an otter an otter cat crazy stuff today in the cat section this guy's mad because the market is not pumping it's not going up Careful with him. These two fighting between Bitcoin and Ethereum again. Why do we have to fight? Let's just admire people that overcome difficulties like this dog jumping a long distance, which is learning from Bitcoin and all this crazy world. And after that, being a pro like this guy going down the stairs, <laughs> having Fun. Remember to chill a little bit to find someone to scratch your back. Do not stop, please. We have no more time today. If you want this in Spanish, go to Fun on the Right, our primary YouTube channel. If you want more in English, just wait till tomorrow. Here, Fun on the Right, health, money, love, party in peace. The best is yet to come and crypto a tope. To the moon!